New Zealand is a modern nation with a culture grounded in its Maori heritage. Maori were the first people to settle these islands. Crossing the Pacific, navigating by ocean currents and stars, they found their way from Polynesia to the shores of New Zealand. Centuries later, the British arrived. And in 1840, they signed a treaty with several Maori chiefs from the North Island. Today, Maori maintain their language, traditions, and the marae, an important meeting ground for each tribal community. And much of their culture has been integrated into the general Kiwi culture. Some young Maori who seek a connection to the past study the old traditions. The meaning of haka, like the ha in the ka, so the ha, uh, the breath of life, uh, the ka, is the energy that we burn. Through high school, I found a strong passion for um, not only haka, but um, for the culture as well. The design is sort of something to show off a bit of um, cultural, be cultural beauty. So usually the girls would just get their chin done. Um, and the boys would get a, either a half face or the full face. Traditionally, the haka was performed by Maori warriors to intimidate their opponents. Today, performing the haka is an embodiment of a centuries-old Maori tradition, and it's claimed an imprint on a larger cross-cultural New Zealand identity. In fact, New Zealand's rugby team, the All Blacks, ritually performs the haka before each match it plays. Oh, 